Enough chit chat. Finish her. Wait, the mob guys attacked us. I have no beef with you guys. You took them out. Listen, I work for Vladimir. Honey, you work for no one. Uh, what do you want? We, we can... NYPD, drop them. Finish her. Oh, God, no. Like all the bad things in my life, it started with the death of a woman. I couldn't save her. After him! Don't let him get away! Damn. Come on! Finally! Hey! Mona? Max, we gotta stop meeting like this. Mona! If you think nothing can get to you, you're lying to yourself. At best, you're temporarily dead. A lightning bolt can reanimate you without a warning.
my backup had arrived, but the cleaners were slipping away, making a run for it. together on this you got sloppy pain you screwed up it's unacceptable that she's dead you can do better I played it as business as usual but everything had changed the moment those elevator doors opened to reveal Mona Annie Finn was a licensed gunsmith licensed dealer in firearms right the property owned by Vladimir Lem three groups one DOAs who had connections to Russian OC Identified as Finn's employees. Two, the Mafia. And three, the clowns wearing the cleaning company jumpsuits. They mentioned a name, Kaufman. This one's evil. It has only started. I don't like it. I don't like it a bit. It's yours, Payne. It makes no sense. For you, Winterson, homicide. Sebastian Gate. It's gonna be all over the news. The Senator. Winterson was the ideal. What the job was all about. Someone to look up to. Bravora knew it too. We got lucky. There's an eyewitness. She hovered over my shoulder, whispering warnings. I didn't want to listen. Mona was the suspect in Winterson's case. I didn't tell them I had seen her. I wanted to stall. Maybe it was because she was alive when everyone else kept dying on me. Survivor's guilt washed away. Detective Winterson's phone. Give me that. Your boyfriend. The computer search on the squeaky cleaning company and Kaufman had come up empty. I needed to talk to Vlad, get his version, be the bearer of bad news on Annie Finn. Vlad had bought the old Ragnarok nightclub. He was renovating it into a trendy restaurant, vodka. Mona's appearance had triggered a dislocation, schizophrenia. I felt elation, but with it, fear that all the past evils had come along for the ride. Memories of my previous visit here lurked in the shadows. A musty smell under the coat of new paint. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to present Max Payne. New York's finest, with the biggest mobster body count ever. Help, stop, Here's Kiss. Hair to die. 